We treat sleep apnea in our office almost every day. Some of the patients that I've treated come back after a year after treatment and tell me wonderful stories like they've lost 60 pounds just because their metabolism has gone to a higher level once they've been treated for sleep apnea. One patient tells me that he went from sleeping four and a half hours to sleeping seven and a half hours a night and he feels much more rested and much more vital. CPAPs aren't the only answer for sleep apnea. There are other things that we can do like oral appliances that help increase your airway which allows you to breathe better while you're sleeping. It also cuts down on snoring and helps you feel more rested in the morning. Sleep apnea is kind of the hidden epidemic in America. A lot of people suffer from things that are comorbidities of sleep apnea. Comorbidities are other sicknesses that go along with sleep apnea. You have an increased risk for heart attack, stroke, diabetes, certain types of cancer. In children, sleep apnea can cause conditions that mimic attention deficit disorder and behavioral issues. It's very important to get your children checked to make sure that they are breathing correctly as they're sleeping. The oral appliance, which is a good solution for sleep apnea, actually holds your jaw in such a manner that it opens the airway to allow more air to get into your lungs. Anybody with obstructive airway disorder, which causes their sleep apnea, is a candidate for an oral appliance.